bags. Only got twenty dollars in my pocket. I, I, I'm hunting, looking for a come up. This is fucking awesome. Ow. I'm gonna pop some tags. Only got twenty dollars in my pocket. I, I, I'm hunting, looking for a come up. This is fucking awesome. So you say you wanna get away. Hey what's up everyone, welcome back to my channel. So as you can see for today's video, we're actually not in my room. I'm actually using my camera like I would vlog in, but it's not a vlog, don't worry, it's not a vlog. I decided today we're gonna do a thrift store challenge. Now I did this and tested it on my vlog channel a few weeks ago. You all loved it, so I'll let you know what. I'm gonna get Haz in and we're gonna do like a thrift store challenge. We're currently in Shoreditch, as you can see. It's such a cool area. How this is gonna work is we're gonna go to a few thrift stores and we're actually gonna pick each other an outfit for the cheapest possible amount we can and we've gotta try and make it look good. I think the lane we're gonna go to is Brick Lane. It's got a bunch of vintage shops. Also so cool. There's one shop in particular that I love. It's all like designer vintage stuff. Obviously not gonna go in there because it's really expensive. So the aim of this video is to try and find cool outfits for as cheap as we possibly can. Hopefully this goes well. Hopefully it goes to plan. I don't know how we're gonna film in these stores. Anyway, enough rambling. We're gonna get in with this video. I don't know how it's gonna go, but give it a thumbs up if you enjoy this style of content and obviously I can get other guests on. This could be like a series, like thrift store series. I also want you to vote in the comments below whose outfits you think are better. My choices of hats styling has or has his choices of styling me. Obviously it'll be mine. Does that make sense? I don't know if that makes sense. Anyway, let's go thrifting bitches. This is fucking awesome. <laughs> This is the vintage shop of actual dreams. Love that. Look how cool this Fendi jacket is. We're trying to find cheap outfits, so that shop's definitely not the cheapest place. However, it is really cute and they do have some really nice stuff in. And maybe one day I'll fulfill my vintage princess needs. Like right now, that's not happening, so we're gonna find some cheap alternatives and hopefully find some good stuff. to warm my top underneath but yeah this is just a night top quite like it don't really like the fact that it's sleeveless i do like the jacket though i think if the denims were the same color this would be a lot yeah that is really cool I like this on the sleeve as well. yeah i like that how much do you rate this out of 10? i rate this a 10 out of 10. i'm a bit torn on what to make byron wear because i like this not for me but for byron and i feel like it's something he'd wear open and then also this but i think he could pull it off but he doesn't normally wear stuff like this so the change rooms are currently occupied, so we're um, getting the we're in the middle of the store. I quite like it though. Oh I just wish it was a bit longer. Yeah, it's not long. If it were larger, it would have some. Yes from me. Alright, so I'm just looking at the trousers and in every shot we've been into, there's some really cute trousers but the waist size is just too big. And if you know has her waist is literally like this thin. So like she's not about to get trousers to fit us, so she's gonna have to wear the trousers that she's already wearing. Also this vintage shop is the coolest thing like, I've ever been to in my life. Like look at this. Wow, we love that. It's called Vintage Basement on Brig Lane if you wanna come and have a little look. What what? What 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 I literally said that I don't think it'll look too bad. I actually don't mind either. So Byron's next outfit isn't actually me trying to be mean. The two jumpers that I picked them out I actually really really like and I want them for myself. So if he doesn't like them, he'll probably cop them. As we said before, there isn't really many trousers that fit him or even look nice in the majority of these vintage stores to be fair. I feel like they don't accommodate for men very well apart from like jackets and jumpers. This is not bad. Like I think this will look so cute if you like crops. But I don't know why I'm feeling this crop moment. I really like it. I think it's so cool. I like it. I would actually wear this like legit. I think it'll be for this outfit as well. It's so funny. 
this is a basic outfit, number two. I don't and like it as much. No, I prefer the other jumper. I think it's because the neck is like white. I don't know. I feel like it's being worn a lot and it's like slouching like. I really, really liked the set the first jumper. I really like the first uh, yeah, the first jumper. I actually really like the drops off. Yeah. Your time, sister. Woo! What, 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 what? What, what? I actually, like it. it's really cute. I like that. Yeah. It's like twenty nine pounds as well. That's not too bad. I feel like you'd crop it a bit more though. Yeah, I would. I probably, I've got my top underneath, but I probably crop it to my hair. I actually really like it. Thumbs up from me. I love that one. Wow, college student who? Harvard University. What? Damn, sis. I actually really like that. How's that so cute? Like, I actually really like that. No, but I love that. You look so cute. Wow, Harvard University really should consider you as a student next year. Wow, I love that. Like, I actually love that so much. That's so cute. Oh my god, I'm obsessed with this jacket for myself. Like, I know I picked it out for Haz, but I really do like this. If it were a little bit bigger, I would actually get this for myself. I think it's so, so cute. We love. What, 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 what? What, what? Oh, wait, I actually get it on, but um, this is what it would look like. Wow, we love... <laughs> we love that for you. I will say that. Wow, scandal. <laughs> so that's a yes for me. <laughs> Alright, so we've just come out of the vintage shop now. That one, honestly, the coolest shop and the workers in there as well saw that we were filming. And they were so lovely about it. Like, so many places are so weird with people filming in there, but they were so lovely. They took us, like, YouTube channels and stuff. So, hi, you're probably watching this. You're so, so lovely. We'll definitely be back in. That was so cool. The outfits in there were kind of good as well. Like, I really liked what I got for Haas, and I also really liked the crop t shirt, so that was really cool. We're now going to look in a few more vintage shops. Like I said, trying to find trousers we found is such a struggle. So hard being slim thick, honestly. <laughs> Retweet if you cry every time. We're gonna try and find a few more vintage shops now, take some photos, and then I don't know what we're gonna do. Final look. Feeling very, um, very cool right now. Like striker pose. Mm, mm, mm. There we are. Fabulous. Love that. So that is the end of this video. I know it's a bit weird the location right now. Look at this, we're in a giant avocado ball pit. If you want to see what this is or what we got up to today, please go subscribe to my vlog channel, check out that vlog. I don't know how this video went, but hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, smash a big thumbs up. Don't forget, like, you seriously need to check out this vlog. I have no idea where we are or what this situation is, but it's the coolest thing ever. And I'm in a giant avocado for Christ's sake. Go subscribe. <laughs> so you say you wanna get away. We don't need a plane. Could be your escape. Take you to a place where there's no 